I came from an undergraduate degree that was very interdisciplinary in nature. I started out as a painter and moved through performance and then finally to photography. When I first came into the program I was doing work about inherited trauma, uh, particularly surrounding the Holocaust. As a grandchild of Holocaust survivors, I was making work about my family. And I think there was a big shift that happened in my work kind of in the first year. And I'm still making work about trauma and ideas of family and how it's inherited. But I think I expanded outwards a little bit and was not restricted or limited by a cultural context. My thesis show has a lot of different work in it, um, all of work that I've made this year and the past three or four months. Uh, the main component is a two-channel looped video that's eight minutes long. That's really focusing on interior architecture, kind of following a single person down a long hallway, um, almost structuralist in nature. But um, the rest of the work involves comics that are hand-drawn, so using text and some image. Uh, I also did some poured concrete pieces and some very sculptural, um, colorful and black and white photographs that kind of are like sculptural reliefs that come off the wall. And I think for me, that was a really important um, epiphany in my practice that the metaphor of folding a single sheet of paper and that one fold is not a single fold but a multiplicity within a single sheet and that in the plane of a photograph, you can fold one event, the past, into the future or into the present. That these things are not independent of each other, that they're simultaneous, but also you can't read everything at once. 